A big part of the governor's plan, sinking millions of dollars into school security. Districts are making changes too. News Channel 8's Rod Carter is live in the newsroom for us tonight with the details. Rod? Uh, Jen, today middle schoolers and high schoolers in Hillsborough County watched a safety video helping them understand how to react in crisis situations. Alyssa Aladef, Scott Beagle, Martin Duque Aguiano. Today, Governor Rick Scott read all 17 names of the Parkland shooting victims. Florida will never be the same. And then outlined his plan to prevent this from ever happening again. A big part, increased law enforcement presence in schools. $450 million to keep students safe. Today, I'm calling for a mandatory law enforcement officer in every public school. In the meantime, school districts are moving forward to prepare students and parents. Please remember, if you see something, say something. In Hillsborough County, officials had every middle and high school student watch this video. It focuses on security procedures and clarifies terms like lock in, lock out, and lock down. If a parent hears that term, whether it's by a phone call by their principal, they kind of understand what's going on at a school. Students say this is needed. I didn't know where to go in a classroom if something like that happened, so I would say I do feel a bit better about it. District officials told me the intent here, not to scare the students, but simply to prepare Prepare them. And another part of the governor's massive plan to require crisis intervention training at all per, to all personnel before the 2018 school year. Andy says create an anonymous K through 12 statewide website and app as well. All of that dedicated strictly to see something, say something. It's an Jen? important message. Rod yeah. Carter, live force in the newsroom. Thank you.